What's going on you guys? This is some XKD. I have another Dell Optiplex. This is 745 mini tower. I'm going to be upgrades. So first you're going to remove the side cover panel. And I'm going to go and upgrade the memory. The memory guys I'm going to be installing is a Corsair XMS2, this is a DDR2-800, 9 and buffer memory, this is really good. And you can use the Kingston Corsair, King, uh, Crucial, those are top three brands. And you're going to be installing the memory in the white slots, this is the first slot right here, the DIM1, and DIM2 is another white slot right there, it's a dual channel. And this is a match pair, a uh, total of 4 gigs, that's 2 gig per each slot. And when you install the memory properly, you're going to hear two clicks. So now, now I'm going to, guys, I'm going to be upgrading the hard drive. There's, uh, I'm going to show you how to do that. So you're going to move the SATA power cable. And move the hard drive KD right here, the blue. It's a 3.5 inch. Stalls like this. And it clips in. And now I'm going to show you guys the uh, upgraded VD card. To do that, there's a latch right here. You, uh, you clip right here, there's a little latch or a little clip where right you press it down gently, finger, release it. And the VD card in here, to remove the VD card, you will need a mini screwdriver because if you can get your finger right here this is a little secure clip you press on right here and all you have to do on the other side otherwise you press on the secure clip right here to release the VD card slides out like this comes out can you see the clip right here you have to press it down if you can't press it down then what you have to do is use a mini Phillips a mini screwdriver press on it from the top right here like this and the, 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 he's got a PCI Express time 16 slot right here. That's where we're going to install the video card. Those are two PCI slots. And the bottom one right here is a PCI Express times one slot right there. And you guys can use the GT, uh, GT730 uh, video card will work perfectly fine in here. You can install like this. will fit. And I'm going to show you guys a uh, new card here like this. It slides in. The new video card is installed. I'm going to latch it back in. And you're done. And guys, the, I'll upload a separate video for the processor upgrade and disassemble the teardown. That'll be a separate video. Uh, the power supply in here is a 305 watts, so you don't even have to upgrade. So you guys, this will be the end of the video. Let me put this in. What you're going to do is you're going to plug in the monitor directly to the VD card. And just download the drivers for it and restart the computer. So guys, this has been another video. Thanks for watching. Bye.